First some United States officials accused Russia of interfering with a presidential election. Now Russia claims some US officials are returning the favor. News.com has learned about accusations by the Kremlin's version of the Secret Service that the Biden administration wants to disrupt Vladimir Putin's likely re-election. Russia will hold three days of voting March 15th to 17th. News.com noted in January that much of the vote will take place online. That opens a door for potential hacking, and the SVR Foreign Intelligence Service claimed Monday March 11th that US agencies are trying to go through it. The administration of Jay Biden is setting a task for American NGOs, non-governmental organizations, to achieve a decrease in turnout, Reuters quoted SVR as reporting. It went on to claim information technology specialists plan to carry out cyber attacks on the remote electronic voting system, which will make it impossible to count the votes of a significant proportion of Russian voters. The SVR cited information received, but gave no other details for its accusations. The idea is simple in the American way, Turkey's Anadolu agency quoted SVR as adding. According to Washington's calculations, the resulting reduction in turnout will give the West a reason to question the election results. The comments followed a summons to the Russian Foreign Ministry in the first week of March by U.S. Ambassador Lynn Tracy. Reuters reported Tracy was warned U.S. diplomats involved in subversive actions and the spread of information surrounding the election could be expelled. There's no response so far to the latest SVR statement from U.S. officials. But monitors of Russia's mostly online vote say Putin's government actually could tap into it to track his opponents. Microsoft claims Russia has its own government-aided cyber attackers. News.com reported in recent days that they hacked the emails of company executives in November 2023. The Kremlin reportedly is preparing its own efforts to disrupt the U.S. presidential vote. The Heritage Foundation's Daily Signal reports it was the topic of a classified briefing for state election officials by the FBI and the Department of Homeland Security in December 2023. A declassified summary shows the highlights of the briefing included a session on how Russian cyber actors could pose a threat to election infrastructure. The U.S. effort to achieve a decrease at the polls could take other forms. United Press International reports the widow of Putin opponent Alexei Navalny is endorsing a mass protest turnout at the polls at noon March 17. Russian ambassador to the U.S. Anatoly Antonov said another concern is security for the embassy in Washington. We are in close contact with the Secret Service of the State Department, Antonov posted on Telegram.